Okay, this one starts with some bends on the 7th fret here like this. Okay, that's uh... That's just the 7th and the 5th fret there. from the 7th to the 9th, hitting the 8th on the B string. Okay, then he does this. Okay, that's um, bending the D against the E. Then, sliding from the G, B, bending the D again, okay, slowly, then this, okay, that's this, sliding from the B to the C sharp, Hitting the E up there in the B string. Two notes on the 17th. Then this, hitting the A and bending them. Then here. That's bending from the F here. C, A to the G. Sliding from the G to the A and the C. Okay, that's bending the D, playing it against the C. Sliding from the G up to the A. And then this. That's just four notes. And then he does this. Okay, so that's just the two notes there at the 17th on the E and the B string. He then does this move he, we did earlier. Okay, and then he does this. Now that's like this lick we played earlier. Except he's starting from the C. And that's hitting the two notes of the 17th again, sliding up from the D. Then finally, uh, bending on the D.
going from the D to the E, moving back down here to the C. You're on the D string there. Then this. That's sliding from the G up to the A. Hitting the C three times. Okay, that's again slide. And then another slide from the D up to the E, hitting on the G twice. So slowly. And that, that's a bit tricky because it's a small space there, so you've got to get your finger in right. Anyway, um, that's a great solo.